You are listening to the family of Tegeta podcast. Message from Neo. Life on Pluto, called Teos. Friends of the great planet Earth. In these moments we will review aspects of life on the star that you call Pluto. While no longer being considered as a planet in the Milky Way by your astronomers and scientists, be assured that the perceived small size of this celestial body is full of life as it orbits the Sun. The extreme cold in your perception is enjoyed by the sacred beings that live there. These beings call themselves Trahu. The name of their home is Teos. They stand ten feet tall with white skin that glows with light. Their body has two legs and four arms. The Trahu are able to climb mountains by using their arms for added strength and mobility. They have no nose but they breathe through the mouth which is circular in shape. They consume water and a substance that grows in plant form and turns to liquid when eaten. Their eyes are circular in shape and pale lavender in color. They wear no clothing. The Trahu enjoy family and loving friendships. They procreate energetically and live in body form for around 1,000 years. They incarnate back into their race on Teos. Their understanding of oneness and duality is real and they are advancing in momentum to become part of the galactic civilization of peace. There are strong disagreements among the race but no war and death as you experience on Earth. Their discovery by the Galactic Federation brought visits with teachings of crafts and technology. This allows travel in large crafts in the area around Teos. They choose to remain close to their home of origin but will venture into the cosmos as unity expands with other races. The Trahu avoid conflicts with others and remain isolated for these reasons. Their homes are surprisingly like crystal palaces. Teos is rich with minerals, lush colorful plants, flowers and large crystals. This allowed for the creation of crystal homes with nature being used for all decor. Pottery and tables are displayed in rest areas and places where gatherings are enjoyed. There is music with many creations of instruments that resemble drums and stringed instruments. Art is enjoyed with sculpting and painting with colors derived from plants, rocks and elements of nature which allows a pure medium with no toxic chemicals. The Trahu enjoy animals that look somewhat like horses and elephants. These are pale green in color and they can run at great speeds. This is the manner of local travel on land for the Trahu as they ride on the backs of these animals and love them as beloved pets. The Trahu are very aware of Earth and the changes and discord of the planet. They have a great understanding of your plight as you struggle to live in duality while choosing war as an answer to solve problems. They also understand the dilemma of those desiring peace and oneness as this is their projection of their own future. Understanding that Teos or Pluto is no longer considered to be a planet has brought to them a momentum of change as their desire to be connected and accepted into the new galactic civilization has increased. With assistance from the Galactic Federation, they will become part of the unity of light. Be as one in love. In light all life will be at peace. And Ikimaiya. I love you so. Neo.